Canada, then. Brazil against Portugal. I'm John Champion, and providing analysis alongside me is our expert, Jim Beckett. And the spectators rise for the national anthem. cut offside but I think you have to accept that as an occupational hazard. It's been mentioned that this fellow was born offside and he'll keep trying until the flag stays down. He'll keep working on it the shoulder of the last defender until he gets real up. Fred, well positioned to lead a breakaway. Here's Cristiano Ronaldo. Jean Moutinho on the ball. Oh. Here's Oscar. A long ball forward. The ball played into space nicely. El de Postiga with a big chance. Portugal have scored. And there's the first goal of the game. Oh, that was a cracking little exchange to set up the finish. And a lovely understanding between both players. I mean, that's clearly tailored on the training ground and delivered beautifully on match day. Also, Paulinho has a hold of him. Paulinho. Here's Fred. Here's Daniel Alves. The keeper's got it. Bruno Alves. Raul Morales. Thiago Silva. And Raul Morales. Now through to Elder Postiga. Elder Postiga. Sprinting through the middle. To be fair, that was tough for the keeper to handle. Bruno Alves. And Jean Martino. Neymar. A really impressive run through. And Marcelo. A long ball into space. He's not taking any risks there. Free kick. Could be a goal here. And he makes absolutely no mistake. And a potentially crucial moment for Brazil. What are your thoughts on the goal, Jim Beglin? Yeah, I've got great admiration for the finish, but I've even more admiration for the pass that set it up. It was delicious.
they kick off with Parity Restore. Yeah, we thought that this one would be close between two strong sides like this, and I think that just goes to prove it. Cristiano Ronaldo has got it, looking for wins. Elder Postiga, Portugal have scored. That could well turn out to be the winner they've been looking for. Here's Marcelo. Marcelo knocks it forward. That's not going to make it through. The whistle goes, and it's the end of the first half. So away we go then for the second half. David Luiz is all over him. Cristiano Ronaldo shoots. Tremendous from Cristiano Ronaldo. It's a two-goal lead now. Well, I think that two-goal cushion they've just manufactured is a fair reflection of what we've seen up to now. It also adds to the, the psychological divide between the two teams. It could make a big difference. Elder Postiga. João Pereira. Fred. Oh, we set up one goal so far. Fabio Coetrao with a crucial intervention. Oh, now Neymar. Paulinho. Neymar, he plays it through, looks like a change is in order, the player there waiting to come on, beats a long ball into space, a crucial intervention there, through the middle it goes, Hugo Almeida, he's onside here, Marcelo, oh, approaching the last 15 minutes of the game, Long ball over the top. He's got possession now. Maybe a chance. Daniel Alves. Well, it's good possession, but you've got to have something more substantial on the end of it. Miguel Veloso. The ball's with Hugo Almeida. Pepe. He moves in swiftly. Good through ball. The flag stays down. Driven in. Goal! Just one goal in it now. The comeback could be on. A great goal from a frankly unpromising angle. And it was very little on, but I think he's done so well to score from such a tight angle. The difference is down to one. Well, they've given themselves a chance here, but now it's a case of getting the balance right between attack and defence, and that's not easy. Hugo Almeida's got it. He's waiting here. Hulk, go on the break if he can be found. The final ball not quite there. So there you have it, the final whistle. In the end, all that separated the teams was a single strike. The keeper will be hurting. He might well feel he should have done better. I think some of the players are going to be a bit sore after that. There was so much passion and commitment out there. I can't remember anyone shirking the tackle.